So uh, I measured my wall from the top of this plate to the top of that plate. Remember I measured that, it was 121 inches. So I had this bird's house set right on there, right, the way it should be. But now up here, this wall, <laughs> it's uh, 122 inches apart. The tops are all lined up fairly decent. But here's the telltale, look at that. I don't know what is that. Three eighths. Three eighths of an inch. Alright, so what I've decided to do is to make all of these 121 inches. Hopefully it'll fit now. <laughs> so I'm just going to repeat that on the rest of these trusses, <laughs> rest of these rafters, and then hopefully we'll be able to set them up and uh, make them fit. Well, it's another day, and we're going to get back at the boathouse. Kind of cloudy and chilly today and windy, but uh, it's not raining, so going to make hay. Uh, what we're up to today is we're going to start to put the trusses up because yesterday I finished cutting off the birds' mouths. And I'm giving up and getting the building any more square and plumb and true as it is. So we're going to start. We're going to, on this right hand side here, we're going to stand that truss up. See where we go from there. Not sitting right down on this right hand side, but I think we can make an adjustment on that and make it fit. So, uh, what was going on there was uh, the truss was about a quarter of an inch too narrow. Uh, so what I did was I cut away the paneling on the left hand side here to let that bird's mouth sit right on top of the plate, right next to the plate, sit over the paneling. And when I did that, moved the truss to the right, and this fits good up here. So now I'm going to just toenail that in and uh, start to plumb it up.
teeth and plum. So uh, that rafter, not truss, but that rafter, that one up there, not too bad considering. Uh, set down good on both edges. I toenailed it now and it's even plumb. So all I have to do is lay out for the rest of the rafter, start standing those up. Uh, in fact, on the top of the plate, the marks are still there from when I built the boathouse, so I don't even have to lay them out. They're all the marks already there. But because uh, it's going to be a problem holding those rafters up, I won't be able to put a, a brace like I have here for this rafter. Uh, my son Chris is coming out today, so I think I'm just going to wait. And when he comes out, then this is a lot easier if there's two guys working on it, right? So we'll go that route. But anyway, it's nice to get that rafter up and uh, the rest of them hopefully are going to go just as smooth.
Well, we got the uh, rafters up. They're, uh, for the most part, they're pretty decent. They fit up there good. Chris and I uh, struggled with some of them. But it's raining now, so we didn't bother putting the sheathing on them. But at least they're up there now, we got something to work with. <laughs> 